Hello everyone. Hope you all are healthy and fine. Santelectual gives you another episode of Indian Patents Act 1970. In this video, we are discussing about another section that is section 11 under chapter 3 applications for patents. We are discussing section 11 heading priority dates of claims of a complete specification along with its relevant rule, form and fee. section 11 subsection 1 it says there shall be a priority date for each claim of complete specification subsection 2 where complete specification is filed in pursuance of a single application accompanied by either a a provisional specification that is complete specification is filed after a single provisional specification or b specification which is treated by virtue of the direction under subsection 3 of section 9 as provisional specification that is complete specification is treated as provisional specification and then new complete specification will be filed later and in both the cases if claim is fairly based on the matter disclosed in the specification then the priority date of that claim shall be the date of filing of the relevant specification the relevant section that is to be mentioned here is section 93 let's come to subsection 3 under section 11 where complete specification is filed or proceeded in pursuance of two or more applications say a single complete specification is filed combining two or more provisional specification and the claim is fairly based on the matter disclosed in that case also there are two points a in one of those specifications the claim is fairly based on the matter disclosed in one of those specifications in that case priority date of that claim shall be the date of filing of the application accompanied by that specification and second point b if the claim is fairly based on the matter disclosed partly in one application and partly in another application in that case priority date of that claim shall be the date of filing of the application accompanied by the specification of the later date subsection 3a where complete specification is based on previously filed application in india and which has been filed within 12 months from the date of application and claim is of course fairly based on the matter disclosed in the previously filed application in that case priority date of that claim shall be the date of previously filed application in which the matter was first disclosed subsection 4 under section 11 where complete specification is filed in pursuance of further application by virtue of section 161 further application means divisional application which will be covered in our upcoming videos and claim is of course fairly based on the matter disclosed in any of the earlier specification earlier means either it may be provisional or it may be complete In that case priority date of that claim shall be the date of filing of that specification in which the matter was first disclosed subsection 5 in any of the other subsections 1 2 3 3a and 4 any claim of the complete specification if it has two or more priority dates in that case priority date of that claim will be the earlier or earliest of those subsection 6 in case subsection 2 to 5 does not apply in that case priority date of a claim will be the date of filing of the complete specification say an application is filed without any provisional specification direct filing of complete specification in that case that direct filing date of complete specification 
will be the date of priority. Next come to subsection 7. It says that reference to the date of filing of the application or complete specification in case of post dating or anti dating. Now post dating partly has been discussed in earlier video under section 9 and partly it will be discussed under section 17 in upcoming videos. Anti dating will also be discussed in upcoming video under section 16. Now, in case of post dating and anti dating, the reference to the date will be the date of post dating or anti dating. Subsection 8 A claim in the complete specification of a patent will not be invalid for there are two points where claim will not be invalid if A. Publication or use of the invention is done after the date of priority of that claim. That is someone uses or publishes a claim where priority date is already locked. In that case, that claim will not be invalid. And also, second point, grant of another patent which claims the invention in a claim of the same or later priority date. Say, for example, another invention of similar type has been granted before the present invention, but it has later priority date or maybe same priority date. Though it has been granted before the present invention, but as the second invention is having same or later priority date, in that case, the present invention or rather the claim of the present invention will not be invalid. Thank you dear friends for watching the video. Hope you all like it. Please give a like, share and subscribe our channel Science Intellectual. We will provide you more informations under Indian Patents Act 1970, which will be very helpful and very relevant for preparation of Indian Patent Agent exam. Thank you so much.